today we are going to look at the nerves of the lower extremity. We are looking at an anterior view. This is the proximal region, this is the distal region up top. So uh, it is a little upside down. As I rotate it, the nerves are in yellow and we can see the femoral nerve on the anterior side of the thigh. As I rotate to the posterior aspect of the thigh, we can see the large sciatic nerve running down the posterior aspect of the thigh. We see it's going to split into the tibial nerve, which runs right through that popliteal fossa, and to the common fibular or common peroneal nerve to run to the lateral side of the leg or crus. Now we are going to look at the nerves that are a little bit more distal in the lower extremity. We can continue to see the post, uh, tibial nerve running down the posterior aspect of the leg. We rotate to the side where we can see the deep peroneal nerve or deep fibular nerve. And at the very distal aspect, we can see the superficial fibular nerve or the superficial peroneal nerve. And those are the nerves of the lower extremity. Hello, today we are going to look at blood vessels of the lower extremity. We have a posterior view of the lower extremity with the proximal area being at the bottom of the screen and distal towards the top of the screen. We are gonna start in the gluteal region where we have a superior gluteal artery, and then inferior to that we have an inferior gluteal artery. On the side of that we have the medial circumflex artery. As I rotate to come to an anterior view, we can see the femoral artery in red right along the femoral vein in blue. Now the femoral artery is going to split into these three large branches. We've got the ascending branch of the medial circumflex. We have the descending branch of the lateral circumflex. And we've got the deep femoral artery. As I rotate again to the posterior view, we can see more distal, the popliteal artery in red and the popliteal vein in blue leading toward the leg or crus. Now we are looking at the distal aspect of the lower extremity. We can see the posterior tibial artery in red and a little bit of the posterior tibial vein in blue. We have lots of arteries branching off this posterior tibial. We can see a couple arteries just below the knee. These are going to be your inferior medial artery of knee and inferior lateral artery of the knee, also known as genicular arteries. We can see the anterior tibial artery branching off and we can see the peroneal or fibular artery branching off. As we rotate it, we can see that anterior tibial artery on the anterior side of the leg show up. We can also see a couple more arteries around the knee. We also have superior lateral artery of knee and superior medial artery of knee. Again, two more geniculars surrounding the knee. Finally, we have a lateral malleolar artery feeding the lateral part of the ankle. And those are the blood vessels of the lower extremity.